I am your host, Jules Juliet. My beauties, my beauties, we have finally opened up in Cali a Ross dress for less. Now, it's been shut down for a while since the quarantine, which it finally has opened up. And I decided to go, as well as many of the other thrift stores have been finally opening up slowly but surely. And this is a lot of me yapping. But you guys, let's go ahead and get started with this spring 2020 on sale, on clearance. I did get a few regular prices, but because I really, really wanted items. Now, let's go ahead and get started with the store that took me the most to find one that was open, which was Goodwill. As you guys know, I have completely changed my room and changed the color. And the color of my room is basically white, gray, and pink. So with that being said, I also downgraded bed from a queen to a from a queen from a queen to a twin. So I need to buy new stuff for them. With that being said, I bought blankets, you guys. I know summer's coming, I know, but I just really wanted it. It really went with the color. So bam. I bought these two. I believe I bought this one before, but I don't know where it's at. So I have this one and this one. And Honestly, I like the color. I really they're like they're exactly identical the color This one's a little bit more on the pinky side, but still like this is identical. I love it I love it. I you know, this is gonna be hard to maintain you guys I saw a TikTok going on that you're supposed to comb it with something, but I don't know what but yes I ended up buying these these were I believe six bucks, which is a steal because they were ten dollars so It was three dollars off. I mean that's better than nothing and I really liked it. So I got these two Going back to that. Then I also ended up buying. OMG, the lady left me the hanger. I ended up buying this, which I actually do like it. I got this for three bucks. Well, four dollars actually. And I do like the fact that it's rose gold because again, my theme in my room is pink, rose gold, gray, white. And that's all I have to say. And I really do like the fact that it's like really like it's like, you know, I don't know. I really like the style. So I was thinking of putting it maybe back there for decoration. I don't know. I still haven't figured it out. I just really liked it. And she left me the hanger. How freaking embarrassing. All my hangers are white or gray. I don't like having black hangers. All right. So I ended up getting these pants right over here. Um, this one was... $4.99 and they are, I don't know what brand they are. Oh, they are Tarek Gear Dry. And I really like the pattern that it comes with. I didn't really find a lot of clothes. Um, I just don't have any like this. So I was like, you know what, let me get it. Why not? And it was right in the entrance. So got it. Then I ended up getting this top. Most of everything that I bought were tops. And again, this one's brand new. It's never been used. This one's from deji and it looks like it comes from forever 21 because of the way that the barcode is and i got this for six bucks i thought it was really really cute very spring very vintagely like and i really liked it i mean i don't really own tops like this at all so i wanted to give it a try i'm sorry if the camera keeps on auto focusing then i went ahead and i got this one which i really do like it it's a zara shirt and I got this one for $3.99. It's in pink. Camera, you need to stop on focusing. Then I ended up getting this one right over here for $7.99. And it is a vest. It is from the brand White House Black Market. And I just thought I liked the color. Look at this. It's like, it's very like neutral. It's perfect for work attire. So I really do like it. So that's why I ended up getting it. Of course, everything I got is because I like, duh. Then we ended up getting this blue shirt, which is like a random tee blue shirt, large. I thought this would be cute with some white shorts or some white biker shorts, but I didn't find any. So I still ended up buying the shirt. And then the last shirt that I ended up getting was another pink top, which is from Nine West and same $3.99. This one was a grand total that I ended up spending was about $60, $60 I think she said. And it wasn't sure. They didn't give me no receipts. So, yeah. Let's move on to the mother load of everything else, which is Ross. Now, at Ross, there's a lot of things that I bought. And no, <laughs> not proud, but I'm satisfied. 
let's start off with this paper right over here. This one did not have a price and it gave me I Love Sarai vibes and because this is how she's decorating her house and I just really liked it and I just noticed that the young lady damaged it when she took it with her. She probably whacked it with something but look at this. I This is not how I want it. This is not how I bought it so I'm gonna have to like glue this. Since it doesn't have a price she gave it for me for $10.99 um, but I think she did that because she damaged it because this is really cute. Really cute. Moving on to the main events. I bought a lot of pairs of shoes. I'm not a brand person when it comes to shoes. I don't really know the best shoes out there. I just don't really own a lot of pairs of tennis shoes to be honest. I only own about three pairs and that's still a lot to me. I still lose them and most of them that I own are Nike brand which tend to kind of like get damage on the front of the, the feet where the toe is. So it's like you're spending like $70 for them to just last you like four, six, nine months. So I was like, I see shoes and there's a lot of shoes in clearance and why not grab the shoes? So let's get started. Um, I got these Pumas right over here and these retail for 40 bucks, which ended up being on sale for $27. Which I think they're a pretty good deal. Look at these. I like these colors. They're like kind of like khaki looking. And they are the soft foam. Oh my god, I feel like a viejita. Then, because we are back to work and we are back on hustling, I wanted to try out these, but I don't think so. I'm going to keep them. These are the Sketcher Foam Memory ones. These were a whopping original price, $34, and clear, reduced price, $23, so $10 off. I'm not sure if I'm willing to wear these. I noticed that, that they're kind of like, I don't know. I don't know. We have mixed feelings. We'll see, because we bought a lot more shoes. Alrighty now. Then we also ended up buying these um, US Polos. Most of the shoes that I found that were on sale or that were really cute were from US Polos or some other brand named Nautica, which... I mean, they look good. They look good and they have a good price. So I got it. So I ended up getting the kind of like light beige shoes, which are really cute for summer, wearing some nice light color shorts. And these retail for $19. According to this, it says that the compatible price is $30. Bucks, so they're $10 off the original seller. Then we ended up actually buying some Nike shoes. I actually have pairs that are similar like this. And I spent $69 plus taxes on them. To find out that there are some at Ross for $30. Bucks. So I'm kind of like in shock. But yes, I got these. And for $30, bucks, I could have bought two pairs for $69. Then we ended up buying some more black shoes. You guys can never have enough black tennis shoes there. Then I got these babies right over here, which have like the extra space, you know, they grasp onto your foot. I just like the style that they are. They kind of look like my, um, what are they called? The Rochers from Nikes. I don't know. I liked it. Oh, I got these for 13 bucks instead of 20 bucks. They were like $7 off. You know, it's 7 bucks. 7 bucks. Then we ended up getting another ones that were on clearance. Same style, same brand. These are actually just a lot more smoother. And these are also for 13 bucks. I like the fact that they have like some cute little pink decoration. Then I went ahead and I grabbed all white shoes. I don't ever, ever own a white pair of shoes. But I decided to hop on and grab some white shoes. Same brand, US Polos. And they are, again, 13 bucks. Original price, 20 bucks. So a lot of the shoes were priced for 20 bucks. But they ended up going on sale for $7 less, which I mean... Then I ended up getting these for 20 bucks, which is the same style as a pink one. They just, instead of having the band in the back, they have the band in the front, which I thought they were really cool. So I got these. Then I went ahead and I bought these, which are like the kind of like the raising eyebrow clean cut as well as your face. And this also helps you exfoliate. I'm the person that kind of like exfoliates my face with the razor sets. It's easier. I like it. Then I went ahead and I got this one right over here, which is from Ross, and I paid $8 instead of $13. So I thought this was a good deal. And this reminds me of I Love Sarai and how she's decorating her house. So it gave me I Love Sarai vibes, so I got it. Last but not least, what I got at Ross was this chair right over here. I thought this was so cute. 
and I ended up buying this one instead of being thirty five dollars. I got it for thirteen bucks. That's a, that's a steal, and I'm pretty satisfied. It's really cute, very cute. Okay, now that we have Ross out of our way, we're gonna go ahead and finish our Ulta haul. Now something happened with my Ulta delivery. It took way too long, so I could not do it together. And when I finally arrived, it a lot of the products were damaged. Mm. I'm gonna show you guys a clip. I went ahead and I got a lot of shampoos, a lot of conditioners, a lot of masks because they were half off from Ulta. I'm only going to be putting the pictures because it is a lot of work of just breaking them up and picking them up. So I'm going to show you everything that I purchased. As you guys know, I remodel my bathroom and the colors of my bathroom is pink, gray, and black as well as white. So the rug that I have for the bathroom is really sticking to my vinyl. So I had to buy a different material, which is this one right over here. And it's white and gray. I'm not a big fan of it, but the other ones were really dirty. And this was the only clean one, so I got this one. This one retails for 15 bucks, and it's regular price because all of the ones that were on sale were filthy. And then last but not least, I got a pink towel because I have so many non-matching towels. Let me know if you've gone to your local Ross. California has finally opened Ross. And for what I was talking to the young lady, they're going to open more and more and more. So all of your local Ross will be open soon. Because I had to drive a long way from the Ross near me. But then again, I drove to a lot of Rosses because a lot of them had a big line. And I was not willing to wait on that line. Like, it was literally around the store. And I'm not willing to wait. Alright, guys, I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and let me know in the comments down below. Have you gone to your local Ross?